Hello guys and welcome to my channel. Today we are going to talk about some RCF speakers. To be more precise, the art series from RCF. They have been around since the late 90s and have proven to be really working horses actually at an affordable price and in my opinion they they are the best plastic boxes on the market. Many of you have asked me about the differences between the R series because to be honest you can get confused very easily because they look alike. The name is almost identical. Let's clarify some of those things. So the R series consists of two smaller families, the 3 series and the 7 series. Let's talk about the 3 series first. Here we have 10 inch speaker, a 12 inch speaker and a 15 inch speaker. They are passive, they all have the same power rating, 300 watts RMS. They use the same high frequency driver, and to be honest that's the only difference between them the size of the woofer. In my opinion, from this family, the passive ones, the best and the way to go is the 312. Because with the 10 inch version, you actually don't have any low end at all. You can use that speaker only as a small monitor, let's say, or, at a, or as a part in a bigger system. And the 15 inch, the 15 inch is just too big for that small high frequency driver and because of that you have a, a gap of frequencies between them so it, it just doesn't work. The, the 312 is the way to go here. In the active line we have the same thing, 10 inch, 12 inch, 15 inch. They also use the same high frequency driver. And being active, there is an amplifier built in. They also use the same amplifier, a 400 watts RMS. Logically, same, the T12 is the way to go we have because we have the same deal as before. But an advantage with the passive ones is that you can plug them to any amplifier so you can achieve a better sound quality with the passive ones. Now let's get to the big brothers, the big weapons, the 7 series. And this is where things get a little, a little confusing. Why? Because we have the first speaker, uh, 8 inch, 10 inch, 12 inch and 15 inch. Again, same amplifier, it's a, it's a 700 watts amplifier same high frequency driver, 1 inch with uh, 1.7 voice code and uh, here we again have the same deal, the 712 in my opinion is the way to go because the 8 and the 10 they just can play full range modes, they are made for monitoring, for small events, maybe, maybe some speeches, some presentations, some stuff like that and again the 715 a 15 inch and a 1 inch uh, driver just doesn't work. So the 712 is the way to go. But things get a little complicated because we also have a 732, a 735 and a 745. So what's the difference? They look alike, same amplifier, not the same woofers. They are better woofers. And the most important thing they use much bigger high frequency drivers. They actually use the 1.4 and 1.5 ones that are used in their bigger systems. You can find those high frequency drivers even in the TT line. So you actually have much better quality products at a very affordable price. My personal favorite from here is the 745 because it's hard to believe but actually the 745, the NX45, the HDM45, the TT25 Mark II, 
they all have the same drivers, the same woofers and the same high frequency drivers. The only difference is the box, but you have a premium quality sound at an affordable price. I know it's a 15 inch, earlier I said that the 15 inch doesn't work, no, it works when you have a high frequency driver that can keep up with the woofer. So in the 745 the crossover point is very low, about 650 I think. So we have a very smooth transition to the woofer from the high frequency driver at a very smooth sound. So this is the ART series from RCF, thank you for watching and if you want to talk about some specific speakers let me know in the comments below. Thank you for watching and see you next time.